Thank you. I, I know I've been coming here very often, but I would like to share some personal, uh, or maybe you can say final reflections, uh, so that you, you are really ready to go and change the world. Um, go make a difference. What does, ask yourself, what does the forum tell me today? I know these things have been repeated over and over, but then, if you want, you can close your eyes, you don't have to do that, but then, do you feel you are being called to build a new world where despair is turned into hope? Do you hear something telling you that you can do something to shed light where there is darkness in the world? Do you feel being called to take leadership? And do you feel you owe the world something? Do you feel you have, you know, a kind of self-awareness in you? Is it possible, ask yourself, is it possible for me to be an instrument of sharing? Can I sow love where there is hatred? I, told, I talked in the morning about children being hated, caregivers being tired and they hate everything. Can, you, can I sow love? Can I cheer up the injured? The children who have lost their parents, the women who have lost their husbands, the deserted, the divided. I talked of the children who are divided up between different caregivers. Am I called? Do I hear that voice that I can go and cheer them up? Am I called to put light where there is darkness? Ask yourself. Should I be longing to give instead of wanting to receive? Could I bring hope where there is despair? Could I think of all those possibilities? Maybe you, you need new hearts from being a student or a teacher into, into, into somebody else, somebody who goes out there, somebody who, who wears a heart of, of helping, somebody who wears a heart of, a heart of volunteering. You see? Maybe you may need more heart than being a student, you may wish to be a volunteer or wear a hat of a donor, as some of you have already promised here, or an, another hat of an activist. Go and raise voices, share information as you have been talking about here, but also activate the governments, your own government, but also other governments. The UN, maybe you need a hat of being a counselor, when you go out there, you will find that there are children who need someone to talk to, someone to hold their hand, someone to tell them that that's not the end of life. Maybe you, you are called to be a guide or a leader. Name it. So please feel inspired to act. And I'm going to leave, I'm not good at singing, but I'm going to leave you with the song which our young people sing when they want to commit themselves to promoting an AIDS-free generation in Africa. So this is what they sing. Youth alive is our motto. Youth alive, we stand together. Youth alive, we have a mission to be the light of the world. Arise, arise, arise. Wake up and lead the torch of life. Arise, arise, arise. The leaders of tomorrow. Arise, arise, arise forever. Thank you.